Hey guys, Sean B here. Today we are playing with Copper and Bulldozer because I watched the Legend Tournament and the heal and the Ignore Defense coming out onto the Ragdoll say bye bye Ragdoll. And now I'm pretty excited to play with my Copper. The last time I played with him was probably when YDCB was still making daily summoner sort of video. Yeah, it's been a long time. <laughs> I don't think I've changed Copper Rune since 2016. Defense, crit damage, and defense. The same goes for Bulldozer, is also going to be defense, quick damage, and defense. Alright, let's go. This is going to be tough, man. I don't know how we're going to win, because defenses these days are made to deal with the simple offense like Copper Bulldozer. So, this is not going to work out too well. We're going to go first, and we try to kill that little fishy. And hopefully we crit her twice in a row. Um, let's just do some more damage here. And then we hope the full power punch. We crit twice. Boom, boom. <laughs> he still work. Oh my god, he still work. I'm so happy. Now we just need to kill this wind panda and things should be pretty easy. Um, let me try to cleanse myself. Because the defense break is really, really scary. Push her down. We can't. I want to cleanse the stun, but we have to wait for a little bit. So who should I focus my damage on? Dude, my girl has pretty decent amount of resist, but this wind panda is landing every single defense break, and that is really, really scary. It's gonna take me a couple more turns before my bulldozer can get his skill 3 back. Gosh, I need to cleanse defense break all the time and also reduce the enemy attack bar. So Olivia is one of the best defense buffer hands down. Can I stun? All right, doesn't seem to stun too easily. We directed some damage to the bulldozer, which I really appreciate stun. No stun as well, and we get defense broken, but it's okay. I'm directing the damage to him because Olivia cannot take too much. Now, nice stun coming out from bulldozer. If you can put some accuracy on him, the default attack stun is pretty consistent. Um, let me put some glancing on you. All right, Bakuni is doing a very good job as well. Now, I don't really need full power punch, but we're just gonna do that anyway, just to get rid of the main threat, because Juno alone, I don't think it's gonna be too insane against my team. She may kill Olivia though, which I don't really appreciate. I need Olivia for more defense buffing for bulldozer i don't want to use all the defense buffer right now because olivia has so much in her and coupled with rakuni the healing is more than enough for this team to survive you can also replace rakuni with many other things like wusa miyang um just really any healer that can cleanse would be pretty awesome even a konamiya as simple as that i want to keep cleansing bulldozer so that he get his full power punch back soon all right i'm gonna push her so that i can have defense buff push on attack bar back and right now he is ready to send this juno to hell boom boom ah so good so so good now the copper game is gonna be a little bit more complicated because i'm not sure how i'm gonna kill the aerial it's really hard to find a team that can really be copper all of them oh no we lost we lost the... Oh, I can defense break though. We lost the... I'm going to put healing over time up. We lost the defense buff. That's going to be tough. Okay. So it seems like this area is on max resist. Unfortunately. But we managed to take away the provoke. Because if we get provoke, that's not going to be pretty. Oh. If I manage to land the attack bar push, this area of resist is not perfect. Which means I can potentially do that. And with that on... I can do very, very good damage. But this guy can heal back very, very fast as well. So I need to use this opportunity when his defense broken to ignore defense. But I don't think my ignore defense is going to stay for too long. That is a Guardian Rakan right there. Oh, no, no, no. My, my, my boy, my boy. My boy doesn't have defense buff. That's very scary. Um, what do I want to do here? I'm going to push myself so that I get my skill 3 back more often. Okay, push a little bit back. Don't get revenge. Get healed up. Oh, but I lose the defense buff though. I can ignore defense of Rakan. But I need to land a nice crit. Okay. Oh, shit. This Rakan. 
This rock can't do so much damage. Oh my god, 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 god. Oh no. Oh no. Even if I can ignore defense Rakan, I can't win. Because I can never kill Ariel. Can I kill Rakan? Okay, we kill Rakan easily, but how do we kill Ariel? <laughs> because my copper has zero accuracy. So there's never a chance for for your boy to to ignore defense. And we lost Fangen. That's huge. Oh no, he's killing my he's killing my copper slowly. Oh no, 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 no. This is really, really bad. Can I can I defense break? No, I can't. I can never do it. Because I can assure you that guy has maxes. Okay, we have defense leader, and I hope this aerial is a HP aerial. Now is the moment of truth. Ah. <laughs> Ooh, first win for Copper Bulldozer in three years or two years. Molong usually have maximum around 55,000 HP or less than that. So a Copper that can do more than that should be able to kill any Molong just fine. And now with shield and defense buff, I'm pretty okay. And the next time I can ignore defense, this Harmonia is going to be the victim. You see that? There's no way that thing would ever break the shield. But I got to say, um, <laughs> my Copper has, I don't know, 85 resist. He still managed to, to put out the, the stun, which is pretty insane. Now I'm going to put heal block on here. Nothing I do now really matter because, oh, I'm fucking violent. The only thing that matter is for me to ignore defense the Harmonia when the Copper has his skill up. And for this Julian to not do too much damage to my, to my team. All right, I'm going to push him. Okay. I don't have the thing yet, so I'm waiting for the chance. Maybe we're just going to distribute the damage right now for her to heal. You see that? With the shield and the defense buff, I'm pretty okay at dealing with this damage coming out from Julian. But his violent proccing may prove to be a problem. Oh my god, he's actually doing very solid damage, not gonna lie. Oh, we're actually doing more than enough damage to him. Oh, no, 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 no. Do I have the shield before he hit? Oh no, I, I'm not too sure. Oh, I do have the shield before he can hit. So I'm going to push it to Kamun just to be sure. And then I'm going to do some damage here. Actually, it doesn't really matter, right? Okay. Stun. The stun is the one that matters the most. Push the attack bar down. Can I do some damage to the Harmonia? So even if I glance. Okay, I'm not moving before the Harmonia. Unwanted Harmony. Okay, he didn't heal. Oh my god, the Harmonia got healed. Don't stun me. How much accuracy do you have? I lost my defense buff. Oh no. I'm in trouble. Can I heal up? Okay, good heal, good heal. I have defense buff next turn, but I need to move next turn. And this Harmonia. Okay, I'm going to move and potentially, hopefully, kill the Harmonia. Can I? No, I can't. <laughs> oh my god, can I crit? Oh my god, that's not enough. Wait, I can kill the Julian now. Oh, the Vio Kamun Violent Proc saved my ass. Oh my god. Ah, oh, Kamun. I love you, baby. I love you. The Vio Kamun saved my ass. Now, is the true test is this a HP or a defense either drill? You can never know. That is the beauty of not being able to see the enemy runes. Now, let's try to destroy this either drill. Okay, Theo. Okay, Theo. Okay, Elad. How many turns do you want to go, huh? How many turns do you want to go? Can I kill? Boom, boom. It is a HP Ela drill, which means the default attack might be able to do it. Okay. Okay, we are semi safe for now because I will have one turn where I don't have the immunity. And this deal has been going two turns in a row. A few moments later. So that we can kill with our full power punch. A vile wolf will be better here so that the immunity uptime will be more consistent. But it is totally fine. If you have a Wusa, this is one of the best, most consistent offense you can use. Are you yawning? This time around, let's bring back the old school copper bulldozer. The 
enemy deafness will take turn one will not be able to kill either copper or immensity our boost copper kill john bulldozer will take care of the wind panda and hopefully whatever left is going to be enough to kill the enemy deafness who's going to have wheel runes everybody's going to have wheel runes which mean i can try and kill this guy i'm going to defense break him right off the bat because there's a good chance my deafness will miss the strip and the defense break so this will just ensure me with the kill he's gonna go back into the bear farm it is totally cool he can buff whatever he wants and then we're gonna kill him once again so as you can see the shield will take all the damage okay i am kind of wrong the shield didn't take all the damage <laughs> i need to push back oh my god i need to push back the perna i'm gonna heal up the daftness that was a decent amount here i'm gonna take away the molong skill too we take away perna skill three the passive as well i'm gonna try to i think the bear might hit the daftness here so i'm gonna push back a little bit i'm gonna kill the perna okay the bear didn't hit the daftness good now we can try to strip that away from the bear we couldn't take that thing away but daftness can definitely take it away so the bear will die daftness will have a seven thousand shield i think that should be enough for most molong damage output from now on, i'm gonna take the molong skill away once again push it back once more and this should ensure my deafness to be able to kill him in the next turn all right that was pretty smooth thanks to the second skill on the perna to kill him quickly I'm fast as fuck, boy. oh my god he actually outspeed me but now it is kind of interesting because i can potentially kill off the deafness and i think with this amount of attack bar my copper might move in front of the john we're gonna kill the deafness here boom boom all right do i move in front of the john oh no i i don't think i will oh the john derp twice but can i kill though i'm actually kind of worried all right i can oh oh my god that john is around 260 speed he only built that john with such a good set for gear defense wow the dedication but the rng today was was pretty smooth i can't lie the rng today are you challenging me was pretty amazing oh wait i think i'm in trouble oh no my defense buffer oh wait how do i kill the panda stun no oh no i do have full power punch but he's not low enough for me to punch oh no <laughs> Hello darkness, my old friend. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Good RG today, huh, Sean? Shut the f If you enjoyed the video, definitely smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment down below if you are still one of those boomers who use copper boodles every single day. I'll see you next time. Bye.